Hello everyone and welcome back to Robinhood Coins. Thank you all for joining us on tonight's half dollar hunt and live stream. Hi. <laughs> I have a little helper right here. We have Maid Marion back there. And Hello. And the littlest helper is playing on my mom's iPad. No, right. I'm not. <laughs> and so everyone's here and we are gonna be going through three boxes of half dollars. But first, I wanted to say hello to everybody. Um, so we have Garrett M. here, rolled up, Mrs. His, his and Her Coins, Jason Bulldog, um, Brooks VP, Clayton Hayes, Grace F6666, we have Catman Duism, Richard Hicks, Appalachian Outlaw Coins, glad to see everybody, uh, Paul Hampton, and we got Is That So Mike, Lance Laudig, hey. Adam N., I already said rolled up. He's been here since uh, he was second. And we He's got uh, Garrett M. was first. Um, coin collecting with Tyler. We have Nick Bond, Mike Pallet, and Apple User Coins and Silver, Byron the Collector. And look, Kathmanduism sent you a sticker. $3.99 super <laughs> sticker. Thank you very much, Kathmanduism. Hey. That's funny. It is a funny sticker. Love that He's sticker. Like, <laughs> and we have Yada99, uh, Mustang Dave, Double O Buck671, Dan Erica. Man, we have a lot of people here tonight. We have Aaron Brenneman, Robert Worley. We got, let's Sil see. The Silver Ingot. Oh, the Silver Ingot, Mr. Vapor520, Silver Hair Seeker, Train Watcher Dawn. Weasel 6-3, Chandra Gibson, Crafty Dragon, Prospecting Coins. I'm glad you guys all could make it. I think that Catman, um, Catman Duism, he um, super chatted every time. That, that sticker, yeah, he sent that sticker last week too. So um, just for looking at a couple of the uh, questions, I think someone asked what boxes we have tonight. And we have a box of the Yellow Loomis. And that box, the Yellow Loomis box, we're going to do last. But um, it is from the same bank, the same night that Rob Finds Treasure had three Loomis boxes that all had silver. So, fingers crossed, that one has some silver as well. And then we have two boxes of NF String and Sons that were picked up last week as well. I could have I thought the one that we're doing right now was Loomis, but no. Right? The Loomis, we'll do it when you guys get back. Uh, mm -hmm. Michael E. Fines, look at what he said. <gasps> we get ice cream. <laughs> The, uh, not the ice cream sticker. Thank you very much, Michael E. Pines. Really appreciate it. Oh, yeah. And about, um, I think we're going to leave. Well, at 7 o'clock, I have to go to my gymnastics class. And it's my first one. Yeah, so we are losing Maid Marion and the Little Helper for about an hour and a half. Actually, an hour. Well, you're going to be at practice for an hour, but it takes 15 minutes to get there. Yeah. So, um, and then Byron the Collector <laughs> said, Hey, Mary Marion, a little helper, and Robin Hood Coins. I know. But I will still be here. Yeah, mm -hmm. we'll have the littlest helper. Yep, we got the littlest helper. She'll be helping me with the chat. and um, Hopefully she doesn't figure out where the delete button is and starts deleting people randomly. Uh, she probably won't use your computer. She'll read over here. No, I won't use the computer. <laughs> Look at that little Andre girl. I know, she is on She's me. like, where is it? Where? Yeah. Oh, oh. oh, he joined on the... Thank you very much, Jason Bulduk. Um, um, welcome to Robin Hood, friends. Really appreciate it. And appreciate all the members that are here tonight. Notice several members here tonight. And um, thank you very much. The, the memberships and the super chats go a long way to helping us do all the giveaways that we do. So... Maybe Marion had something. I was just going to say, Yada99 said, Hi, little helpers. Glad you liked all the stuff I sent. Yeah. We loved all the really stuff cool. you sent. I know, your little mic those microscopes work pretty well, huh? Yeah. Do you want to see them? I'm going to go get them. <laughs> so 
Yeah, no, that was a lot of fun. They, they really enjoyed that. That was good stuff. Um, so, I was going to ask, does everyone... Does everyone like going through the opening the boxes and looking for enders? Or should we just rip off the top and jump in and forget the enders and just get going? Let's see what everyone says in the chat. Maid Marion and I were talking about it and it, it probably takes five to ten minutes to go through all those. Um, so here is the littlest helper. She kind of claimed that one. Even though that was from me. Oh, <laughs> that's hers. Oh, sorry. Hey! <laughs> she you? said that she wanted that one because of the bugs on the cover cover of the box. Yeah, I love. She loves the bugs. Share them. Yeah, that's a good idea. Oh, share them I, is a great I idea. I always um. Now you gotta figure out what you're gonna do. So rip it off. Someone says, just go with it. Wing it. Um, looking for enders. I'm all for the enders. Get going. Forget the enders. <laughs> Send it. No enders. I feel like look for enders. Was better. Just go straight. No enders. I feel like no enders is the the right. The all right. right. So. Yeah, I think no enders. Either. You know what you could do. Daddy. We'll check for it's enders. On the Loomis box, you could look to see for enders. Can I start off the box? Uh, yeah, you can start off the box. Yeah. Or you know one thing, I could still unload them, and you could look at the top and then give it a quick glance. I'll flip them when I put them down. Okay. Does that sound? Yep, that sounds good. Then All right, little Liz Helper. Yeah. All right, we're just going to jump in here. That probably works out best anyway, because there for a while, I will... Uh, We'll be riding solo, or me, me and the littlest helper here. So, yeah, we're going to jump in there. Hopefully oh, she brings us some silver luck. We find a bunch of silver. Oh, sorry. So we can give some away. I will and win I, silver luck. That's what I'm talking and about. I will check with the microscope. I will also. But I like this one because it has a good light. It goes straight, like... Oh, that? I think I just Did I mess you up? Uh, let's see. Sorry. No, you're fine. I'll fix it in a second. But plus, if... I had to update the board. If I find silver... I forgot to do that. If I find silver, I'll be the I'll first one to... Board. If I find silver, then I'll be update the... Update the board means um, you add more things, not like... Take well, I had to reset it to zeros because we haven't found any silver yet. Yeah. Yada 99 pointed it out too. Reset the board. You are right, right Yada 99. Oh, woohoo, empty the board. And there, I I think I've been watching your videos. I think. But oh, I've been watching these, um, these, like, these cool, um, DIYs. And it said woohoo woo at first. No, I don't think so. They were that. <laughs> She's like, no, I don't think so. <laughs> it had like hoar all, o all over. I really think it's your chance. All right, get into the next one. I'll keep going through these. You find us some silver. But also, if I find the silver, then I'll wait, be the... Wait, Brad. <laughs> Brad kind of says, I see silver. <laughs> but also, if I will be the first one to find silver, then I will be the first one to look through the microscope with it. No, it's not silver, but it is an 1873D, so we... Oh, no, coins off. Any coins off. Can check for the DDO. No DDO. We found a couple DDOs last week, so that would be pretty exciting if we uh, found a couple more this week. But I am hoping that we find some silver tonight. Oh, it is the second so Sean said you're using the wrong mat. Oh, hopefully this is the right mat because hopefully we find a bunch of silver. I could use the... Uh, it the, is the right mat. The Stacking silver. Well, it depends. 
you might want to say w use the uh, clad coinage mat. We're just foretelling what we're going. We're putting yeah. silver out there, so. Exactly. Oh, um, yeah. We're calling this shot ahead of time that we're going to find silver. Appalachian Outlaw Coins. My dad's um, yet to find the 1973 um, DDO2. Whoa! No, I have found one. I think we might have even found one on the stream one time. I was thinking we did, too. <laughs> uh, this is... This is Paul Folden, which coin mat yeah. should I use? We got uh, right here. We got the stacking silver. But also, um, these two coins look weird because this one's very thin, and this one it 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 it's like, like beat up. Yeah. This is not the Loomis box. No, we're doing a Loomis box last. I'm just keeping my eye. For, um, I'm really just keeping my eye out for a woohoo. That's all. For a woohoo. Hey there, JW's Coins and Hobbies. He also oh, says hi to Groovy Girls TV. Yeah, that's which is hi, JW. That's me, that's me. <laughs> and that's also our channel. What did he say? I know. What did Paul Folden say? Oh, he said laugh out loud. But I could I I thought you meant to, to look at the clad coinage because you're gonna see more errors and varieties than silver, which is generally the truth. <laughs> Paul says I didn't I'm see the stacking silver, but it's good. I'm literally looking out for Ruhu rather. Morally. Let's see. Oh, and then we have Jan Lewitt here. Good to see you too. Woo Brad Kearney. I didn't see him earlier. <laughs> Sherry <laughs> Ward. <laughs> Spooter Doggy. Doggy. How you doing? Another Tuesday. Another cool search for silver at Robin Hood Coins. Yep. And hopefully we have some good luck. But Yana Yon, Yon 99 said silver is good. Silver is good. And a little list helper over here is gonna find us some. A little helper, did you wanna go through some? Cause if so, then you should let Yeah, you work. should you should do some um, first if you wanna do some before gymnastics. Not tonight, you just want to read the comments? Yeah. Well, I might do so when I come back. Give you $500 for the Loomis box? <laughs> uh. Brad said 501 I don't know who said 500 but... Uh, Brad Kearney said 500 Wait, that's who said um, one, 501 Brad Kearney said 501 yeah, we're not selling it, but we will be giving away some of the silver that we find. If we have find I like it. Awful confident there. It wasn't if we found Wait. silver. It's like, we'll be giving yeah, it away. Yeah, it's got to have silver. Even if it's only three or four, it's got to have silver. Um, Can you throw away the wrappers for her? Archaeology and Mike. Um, if it doesn't, something. then that will be a bummer. Um, that will be a bummer. <laughs> Archaeology Mikey 007 said, Rubber coins, I will be getting a surgery next month on my teeth because I have a rare con con condition? condition that my bottom my bottom row teeth is growing faster than my top teeth. Oh. oh. Well, good luck. Yeah, good luck. I hope everything goes well. And a speedy recovery. Yeah. <laughs> And also, we just went to the dentist today. You mm -hmm. guys did go to the dentist today. Yeah, and just classic, uh, classic little helper fashion. They start telling, telling everything. Yes, they were talking about the channel. They yeah. talk about the channel. They talk about um, eating too much candy. I guess I've been buying too much candy lately. <laughs> and I was like, that's the last person you tell is the dentist. Getting me in trouble. Wait, stop telling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
You can tell them. <laughs> it's fun. Well, it's I'm fun. Still, <laughs> I'm, I'm still seeing if Woohoo's sneaking around. Um, speaking of Woohoo, I actually have some pictures to show you. Your mom could um, probably open it up on, um, if you go to Yahoo, my Yahoo account. Oh, let me see. Uh, it are should automatically squirrels? log in if you go to Chrome and then are just take squirrels? it to Yahoo. Are they squirrels? Um, no, they're pictures of the Sundays. Remember the ice cream Sundays? Ooh, I want to see those. From Japan? Um, but also, from the dentist, they gave us prizes. Right. From the dentist, they gave us prizes after. And I got a slinky, and my sister, she got this, um, it's a necklace, but it also has lip gloss. Here, I can show you guys. Careful. This is the last roll, and I'm gonna let my dad do some. And you got it started for us, huh? Mm -hmm. And then I like this some more. <laughs> it is, is it pulling up or? Yeah, I found it. Uh, but yeah, show the girls those pictures. Nope. They'll probably like that. Oh. What is it supposed to be up? I'm getting like landscapes. Oh, there's some. There's some of um, some ice cream sundaes, and then pictures of Japan, different places in Japan. I'll show them later. It's not a problem. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, well, all right. Japan. Silver nitrate. Hi, all. I'll be listening while I drive for a bit. Well, good to see you, silver nitrate. I know the time difference is. Off for you out there in Hawaii. Ew, a bread inside the uh, American dog parfait. Oh my, how do these people like this stuff? I know, he sent... Woohoo, last, uh, last week was telling us about um, some sundaes, ice cream sundaes that were like flavors of corn dog and all kinds yeah. of crazy stuff. And one thing looks like it has like gold. Like I it's oh like yeah, gold foil. Gold. Yeah. And this is the sling I got from the dentist. Wow. Slinky. Slinky from the dentist. Slinky. This one's for sure. Wait. <gasps> this one's for silver. Thank you very much, JW. <laughs> Thank you, JW and Coins and Hobbies. JW Coins and Hobbies with a $5 super chat for silver and the $10 super chat for ice cream. And also, Stream Boss, um, JW Coins and Hobbies is now the Stream Boss. Thank you very much. You did um, a happy face. Silver. I know, we ice gotta find cream. some silver. <laughs> Um, can you Look what he did after that. Yes. He literally did um, the silver thing and then ice cream emoji. <laughs> yeah. Right after. I didn't realize I didn't have a screwdriver here because the littlest helper just uses her fingernails. Oh. Yeah, I don't know why, but... And now Daddy has to. Yeah. <laughs> Daddy can't use his fingernails. I can. Oh, and we gotta fill the board here. Fill the board is going to bring us some good luck so we can fill the board. That is going to be great. <laughs> I keep checking Brad the time. Says, hope, hope Dennis isn't watching stream. That's oh, true. <laughs> that's true. I mean, they did tell the dentist about the, the channel, but hopefully, uh, Hello. hopefully she's not watching. Squeaky. Yeah, that's it. Be like, got to see the coins. We these want, are all the YouTubers. They want to see when we catch that silver. They want to see. Um, uh, I and the ponies. I wish, I wish I could ride a pony really bad. Have fun at work, Ragnar Magnus. If you're still here to hear that, hope you have a good night at work. Oh. Hi, Coyote Rack Whacker. Coyote Hi. Whacker. We like the name, but coyotes don't. And the, and the um, 
It's a little wolf. <laughs> I think it's a little cut. Okay, you Wait, in a black suit. Like it's getting um, a haircut. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what it looks like? <laughs> yeah. I don't know what she's saying. Ice cream, you scream. We all scream for ice cream. Oh, um, that's actually, that's the song that we have at, um, our school. A bunch of people on that tree. Yeah. Huh? Ice. Ice cream, you ice cream, scream. Yeah. We all scream for ice cream. Nope, the dentist isn't watching the screen. <laughs> stream. That's right, Brad. That's what we are hoping. Oh, Dennis isn't watching the screen. The stream. Yep. I don't know why, but I keep wanting to say scream whenever I think <laughs> <Yeah>. of <laughs> stream or even ice cream. It doesn't want to say scream. Yeah, I keep thinking I'm going to say ice cream. <laughs> But there's no reason to scream. Except for a Benji. Yeah, if we found a Benji, maybe. But. Winky emoji. Hurricane delayed us to the mountains heading out in the morning. Hmm. Well, hopefully you don't get caught up in the hurricane at all. Yeah. Or the aftermath. Guess what, guys? I have four bugs right there on my arm. Now I have five, and uh, one, two. The bugs just love her. And I have four on my arm, on my leg. If you find another Benji, you might have to mute the mic. Yeah. Yes. Maybe. <laughs> if I'll she have... if she finds it, we mm -hmm. might have to mute the mic. You are right. Because I will scream. <laughs> You but are if, right about that. If, um, when we leave, then we'll definitely... Wait, I know what time we should leave, actually. I guess I'll have to find the Benji while you're gone, huh? Yeah, you'll have to try to find <laughs> So I'm only sure <laughs> She I can... said, yeah. I would have said no. She's like, yeah. So that would I be bad. <laughs> so I wouldn't scream, you silly. But then you wouldn't know that, that we found it. Eh, I don't care. I'll still see you after. I'm gonna go back. Alright, hopefully the NF String and Sons gives us some silver. Uh -huh. I have three more proof sets coming. Cool. 64, 71, and 72. Well, nice. We, well, my dad, he bought a whole box of like folders and that stuff. Completely. I did buy a bunch of boxes of tubes because Maid Marion over here is organizing all of our quarters. Which takes she, like two she, hours. She already took all of the uh, nickels that we had, the 40s and 50s nickels, and she labeled all the tubes in a nickel box, uh, the BCW tubes. And so she got those all labeled for me. And now she's working on the quarters. What a nice mama. Yeah, it is nice. Thank you, thank you. And once I have them all organized, it'll be easier to keep track of years that I need good condition ones. That was our dogs. Did you guys see them in the background? Because we have a, I do find a decent amount of 2010 and 11. But I just don't find them in very good condition. The 2010 and 11 quarters. Um, Jan Lewis said, this is for you, Mom. Jan Lewis said, good job, Maid Marion. Thank you, Jan. Thank you. I think that's my new forte. I kind of really no. like it. Yeah, no, she's really good at organizing. Those are our dogs. If they keep growling, you might have to kennel them up. I will. If they keep growling and fighting. Well, I'll just lock them in the room. What else is going on in there? So her secret. Oh, go ahead. Go ahead. Um, that's all. Oh, go ahead. Um, 
Oh. Silver Heart Seeker says, okay, TJ, here's my weekly eat your heart out. I scored a roll of readable date SLQs, mixed dates, and mixed mints, $5 each. Do you know what SLQs are, or is it just me? Yeah, Standing Liberty Quarters. That oh. is awesome. Two uh, two rolls? Uh, it's, it says a roll of readable date. Standing that Liberty. is awesome. It's hard to find those. What the... Uh, you you bought each roll uh, with for five bucks, or is it five dollars each quarter? I think it's just for five bucks. The whole Either way, that's awesome. Again, Jan Louie, you did that trick again. You know it's dogs, not cats. <laughs> I what did he do? It was your cat. Oh. <laughs> Again. <laughs> That's cool, Sarah so Harris. That is cool, actually. That is really cool. LOL and my emoji. Is that you? Wait. Per quarter. Oh, so that must have been a lot. No, that's still pretty good, though, because, um... That's about that's twenty dollars face uh, twenty dollars twenty times face value, yeah. um, but at today's spot and for readable date SLQs, I mean before the price jumped, it was twenty dollars. Yeah, he says thirty cents over melt. Yeah, Jam, that's very good. Jam Lewitt, you got, you were not supposed to forget. You were supposed to forget. No. He's saying you are supposed to forget. No, I know what you say. I remember. <laughs> I remember. Sadly enough, their memory is very good. <laughs> Happy enough so that we can always remember ice cream and candy. I know. You, you say something and then like you drop it because it might not happen. And then a couple of days later, it's like, oh, when are we going to do this? You said we were going to do this. Well, if you can wait a couple days. Yeah. I can't. I told... Hey, Mary, how about we leave at... Um, <laughs> how about at... 35. How about 640? 640, sure. Okay. But it takes 15 minutes to get there. So that way you'll be five minutes early. No. Oh. I will? I said it was seven. Yep. All right, let's see what else is going on. You said it's 15 minutes, and if we get there, there then we'll only have 10 minutes. Because it's at 40, right? 40, and it's going to take us 15 minutes, which is going to get us there at 6.55. Uh, oh, okay. <sighs> All right. But it is very close to that time over here. Did anyone else score any good deals this past week on any silver or numismatic Ba-ba. coins? Ba-ba. I didn't buy any coins this week. He tried. He well, tried to get oh, uh, yeah. silver bars. Remember? Oh. When? Um. Remember in Little Rock? Yeah, that wasn't last week. We're all waiting for the Loomis. I know. But I, I had to end on a good note. I had to end on a good note. Okay. So I found a strange mint mark or mint error recently and can't identify what it is. Can I post a video of it here so someone can help? Can yeah. Sure. Can we'll help. Can you post a video on it? Yeah, chat? you can post a link. What what it's frowned upon is when people like spam it or just randomly throw stuff in there and and it fills up the chat and then people can't read what's going on in the chat. But okay. Catman Duism said bought four rolls. Hang on, it went. Bought four rolls of so-called vintage pennies. Went through them. 
This is what I got. Four Indian heads and a 1909 VBD. 13 in the from from 1910 through 1919, 27 in the 1920s, 95 from 1930 to 1949, and 58 in the 50s. Wow, that's a nice score, especially getting the VDB. That is nice. Hey, I see that. It's cash. Okay. I have three SLQs. Only can only can read a date on 1930. Twenty rolls, four silver. Uh, Brad Kearney, twenty rolls of what? Half dollars or quarters? Or quarters or could be dimes. Could be nickels. Mm -hmm. Oh, we had a you got a nickel hunt posting soon. That yep, we, we got, got a few little goodies in. Yep, Thursday's nickel hunt that's posted. On Thursday has some goodies. That'll be fun. Um, some cool silver. Oh, and I cannot wait till that battle that we're doing with Rob finds treasure. What I battle? Think, um, the nickel battle. Oh, well, that's that might not happen. Well, that's in hopes. We gotta see. Yeah, it's up to him. I've already... We'll see what he says. You already asked? <laughs> um. Let's see. Outlaw coin. Uh. Galactic coin stacker says, Be safe at gymnastics. Yeah, they, they keep us safe at all. <laughs> at all times. <laughs> Completely. So I'll be safe. All the way. Also, the other thing that the uh, Little Helpers have been having fun with the last two days is our community finally opened up our pool. Oh, yeah. And it's so much fun. Um, Thursday morning, we're actually going to go there because we actually met some friends. We're going to go there to meet them at Thursday morning. But we are also hoping to do it again today. But um, we don't think so because we have the live stream. <laughs> Merman with a 9.99 super chat. Hey, Robin Hood coins. I'm new to your group, but wanted to say hello and pay it forward. Good luck. Thank you very much, Merman. I really appreciate it. Wait, Merman? That's like a mermaid. Uh, but it's not. It's Merman. It's a man. That's a mermaid. Thank you very much. We appreciate it. Hope you guys enjoy the stream. And hopefully we find some more silver. <laughs> um, no, I'm laughing because Brooks VP said you have a com community pool. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, our uh, neighborhood. There's a uh, a pool and in our neighborhood. And there's three actually. There's two big ones and a little kitty pool. <laughs> We always hang out in the big one. Yeah, we always like. Oh, and our friends actually have diving wings, and they let us use them. So I actually really practice in like the four feet, and I dive down to grab them. I don't really dive down. I um just like swim. I like in water, and then I um like. Kind of dive down a little bit, but not really dive. Yeah. You can't dive. The flying Twinkie, I don't know if you uh, saw it, and you might see it at the end of um, at the end of the stream, but on the pre-stream pics, we have a picture of that uh, chocolate-covered Twinkie I told you guys about last week. I made a circle, and one of my eyes are red. I was at a shop and they had it, and I thought of the flying Twinkie. I had to, had to buy it and give it to the girls. I think it was the girls' first time ever having a Twinkie. Yeah, it was our first time. Uh, I had a playground, some dirt, and rattlesnakes out here. 
Rattlesnakes, I am staying away from that place. Rattlesnakes! <laughs> <laughs> and we have Far North Coins. I Good to see you here, Far North Coins. I, I completely hate rattlesnakes because they, they have venom. They do have venom. I am not playing with one of those. You no. probably shouldn't oh. play with a rattlesnake. No, that's probably... <laughs> that's the favorite thing to do. But not always play with a rattlesnake. We've gotten a couple beat up uh, NIFCs. We'll put them on the board, but those aren't ones that I would generally keep. I would. <laughs> well, you'd keep everything that you find. You'd be you wouldn't be hunting very long because you'd run out of money. Oh. Did you like the Twinkie, Jen? Lewis says. Mhm. Mm I loved it. It was actually really good. And anyways. Have you guys noticed my thing's actually black and white? Um, black. Galactic Coin Stacker says, thought you liked snakes. I do, but I don't like venom ones. Not venom ones? <laughs> but, this, but this is not the ones that'll kill you. But well, the, all the others are okay. Pythons. <laughs> they're not venomous, are they? No, but aren't they the ones that squeeze you? <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Uh, you guys might freak, I've been watching be freaked too many movies. Uh. <laughs> I have a cobra. <laughs> you have a cobra? Yeah. Yeah. No. It's invisible, you sillies. Yeah. What did uh, what did Flying Twinkie say? When Sophie the Wolfie was younger, I would always say kitty pool to talk about the kids' pool. But she heard kitty pool, so she always called it the cat pool. <laughs> it took me forever to figure out why. <laughs> <laughs> it's because she's been hearing kitty pool, but it's really a it's really a kitty pool. Yeah, no. Yeah, I think everyone got that. <laughs> Did she bring what? Did she bring did she bring cats in it? Hopefully not. Cats yeah. usually don't oh. like water. Got a few more folks here. We got uh, Nancy Barber, Prospecting Coins. Looks like uh, T. Levitt Coiner may be here. Jessica Poulin. Good to see you all. Hopefully you guys brought the uh, the silver luck with it. Oh, and we also... Pull some I, silver out of these NF String and Sons boxes. Also at, four, at 640... Um, we're going to go, I'm going to go to gymnastics. Yeah. We're going to keep hunting for the silver. Hope everyone is well. Dad, S is here. Wait, oh, it's Chad. Don't shake the screen. Oh, Chad Smiths, yep. Good to see you here as well. There's a YouTuber called Chad Wyo Clay. <laughs> it's, it looks like a painted yellow. It doesn't really look that gold. And the other side, the other side isn't. Oh, so. Strup, just subscribe. Thank you for subscribing, Strop. Really appreciate it. Join in the channel. Thank you so much. Wow, Ooh. look at that one. I'm That's it. an interesting looking one. I'm keeping it. <laughs> Little helper thinks she's going to keep it. <laughs> I'll set it aside for now. At first I thought it might have been a proof, but I think it might just be polished. I think it's yeah, just Yeah, I think shiny. it's just polished. I think it's just shiny. <laughs> Hopefully we can find ourselves a DDO tonight. Can we never find real gold and coins? There are gold coins, but you usually won't find them in circulation. I really hope we don't get a circulation one. Uh, a cir I hope you're doing well as well, Jessica Poulin. I can't wait to go to gymnastics. <gasps> Four more minutes. Four more minutes. minutes. In southern West Virginia, they released 50,000 rattlesnakes because they were disappearing here and get in big trouble for killing them. Wow. So they put more rattlesnakes into the... Or they released more of them into the wild. That's and crazy. And a lot of uh, people in my neighborhood killed rattlesnakes, but I had to... 
I have to save them and release them. That must be scary for you. <laughs> Maybe not because you always, I bet you do that every single year. <laughs> because usually every year um, they kill round snakes. Maybe because they want their skills to make stuff. Yeah, there they could be killing it because they're afraid of them. I'd get in a lot of trouble then. Yeah, about when we uh, we grew up in Arizona. Mhm. Mm my mom and dad. And I'm pretty sure there was no rules against killing them out there. Because were they like thousands of them? Oh, well, I think there's. Yeah, they're, they're. I don't think they're endangered. That's for sure. Yeah, there's so many. I found a coin on the ground. You found a coin on the ground. Well, thank you. Yeah. I hope we find silver. Yeah. Two more minutes. Well, actually, one. Get you a 1970 tonight. Thank you very much, Ringmaster Ray. I hope you are right calling that shot. That would be awesome. I'd be so happy if I found a 1970. Oh, yeah. That would be I am amazing. not expecting to find a 1970 at all. Yeah. Nobody will get in trouble for hitting like button. Yeah, nobody will get in trouble <laughs> hitting the like button. That's right. Nope. No one ever got in trouble for that. One more minute. One more minute and then you get to go. Well, actually, it is three more minutes. Um, I don't really count. I do it like the days. I count the ones between the day that we're on and the day that it is. I got mine. I got got mine from a meat set. Oh well. Yeah, that's how I ended up buying one too. Is I bought a mint set just to be safe, just so that I had one. But I am still holding out hope that I will find one in have rolls. Fun at gymnastics. I will try to have fun at gymnastics, Jan Lua. I will have to try. I'm looking at it. I'm like, what is it? What is it? What is it going to turn 40? What is it going to turn 40? Oh, you guys calling people names? Lance Wait, says, I've been called me. worse than a poacher, lol. Oh, no, I think someone um, someone said it's poaching to kill the rattlesnakes. Oh. It's, um... Hey! Thank you. Okay. Let's go! Bye-bye. Uh, would you, uh... Bye -bye, guys. Would you mind um, laying out the next box? Um, we still have 11 rolls left of the first box, but is I that, figure I'll have her. Is that so Mike says don't flip out? Don't flip out. <laughs> All right, hopefully, let's get some silver. Garrett M is hunting some dimes. Hope I can I find my first silver. I hope you do too. Dimes are tough. I was just gonna read that. Oh, were you? Yeah. You could read another one. Huh. Um, Spooky, um, Pluto Doggy said, uh, I can I can you can't read it? Uh, yeah, because it already passed. You can pop out the chat and you can stretch it all the way to the top of the bottom so that way she can read it. <laughs> Did she figure it out? <laughs> <laughs> all right. Bye, little helper. Galactic coin hunter says. Bye. -bye. I can't go behind. I can't go in the camera. Hey, hey. All right. Let's see what else we got going on here. What is the oldest coin you found? Coal, roll hunting and outside of it. I think. 
What's the oldest one we've found not coin roll hunting? That would probably be something my dad gave you. Yeah, but found. I know that we, um, we found a weedy sometime, didn't we? And we found an Indian hen before. That was coin roll hunting, though. We didn't find it, like, on the street or anything, did we? I don't know what you mean by making the chat bigger. Um, there's three little dots at the top yeah. of the chat, and you could say pop out chat. Oh, okay. And then you can just stretch it to be bigger. I think the oldest one I found is the either either an Indian head scent or I think it might have been the V nickel. I got to go back and look. Someone asked before, and I'm pretty sure the V nickel that we found three or four um, nickel videos ago is the oldest coin that I have found oh, coin rolling. Claire, Claire, bye. But Claire, um. Someone, um, uh, wait, um, Gladiant Coin Stacker said bye, little helper. Bye. And also, um, Nancy Barbie, are you saying awesome? Wait, what? I don't get it. Little helper. Go. You gotta go. Um, uh, but bye -bye. what about, what about all you guys? What's the oldest, uh, what's the oldest coin that you guys have found coin roll hunting? I would love to hear that. A nineteen an eighteen twenty two coin without a metal detector. Was it just on the ground? Like surface find? That would be crazy. That would be really crazy. Hmm. Yep, keep watching the chat there, little Liss Helper. Oh, and also, um, the flying t Twinkie did say, have fun at the Nazis, little helper. Yeah. But we, what are the oldest coins people found? I think they're starting to, to tell you. So, wait. 77 Nickel says Bucky USAF Bernie something. Oh, Buckeye USAF Veteran said um, 1947 Nickel. And then you got Dan Erica, 1966 Indian Head. Wow. Or is it a 1947 Buckeye USF or, or an 1847? Oh, Adam N says maybe a 1910s, uh, maybe a 1910s Weedy. Nice. Ooh, that would be great to see. I'm get one of those. Lance Lodig says a 1905 Indian. Uh, Chandra says 1906. Garrett M, 1909. Dan Erica, 19, 1866, was on the grass. Tom at K D. Yeah, surface find. That is crazy. In 1880, or Jason, what year was that? Um, Jack, Jason Buckeye says 1843 Liberty Head Penny. Metal detecting is my, um, my, my. Wow. That's I've heard so many stories of finding super old coins metal detecting. It is on our list of things to do. Got it, Buckeye USAF, nineteen forty-seven. And what we got here? Nineteen eighteen Walker. That's a nice find there, T. Love the Coin Hunter. Love to find a 1918 Walker. That would be great. Heck, I'd love to find a Walker in the rolls again. Period. Have not found many. Yep. Keep reading. Keep reading. You read while I I search, and I'll let you know if we find any silver. Wait. Coin Hunter says 
Mine was a 1918 walker. Yeah. And then Lance Loddick said oldest detecting was an 1804 large scent, 1905 coin roll hunting Indian. And Mr. Weber 520 says 1917 weedy. Nice. What else are they saying? Who else says they are theirs? You got Wisconsin Scratches, says 1898 Indian Head. Where's the jacket? Two 1908s in one roll. Oh, nice. Um, the jacket's not on my screen anymore. Uh. What happened? What'd you do? I didn't have the... You can't touch it. Or don't mess with it. Mm. Just read. All right. You know what we're going to do? We're going to go ahead and give away. Oh, give away. Give away. Uh, we're going to go ahead and give away to 1965. Wait, hold on. Um, but before we do that, actually, because the, the chat's going to start racing. So... I wanted to see any other. I read someone found six figures worth of silver's coin metal detect or coins metal detecting. Nice, 1940 Walker and a coin star. Chandra found and then Phil the board found 1911 Weedy. Sherry Ward said 1904 IHP. Dang, that's nice. 1911 P Weedy. That is good stuff. You are right, Mrs. His and Her Coins. It is an 80 percenter. We're going to give away an 80 percenter. Um, we did a... We got some customer wrapped rolls from a bank. And I shared it on a... Um, member video for Silver Arrow... Silver Arrow members. Because I'm trying to do an extra video for Silver Arrow members. And so we opened up, um, um, I think it was like 20 rolls, and the little helper found these two coins in customer wrapped rolls. It was awesome. And so in order to enter this giveaway, go ahead and, and comment in the chat, and we're going to open up the last three rolls of box one. I found a mason jar full of change and stuff like a time capsule. That is cool. So make sure you comment in the chat to be active in the chat, and then I'm going to use the night bot to pull someone's name from active in the chat, and it goes for the last six minutes, so if you comment now, by the time I'm done with these three rolls, you will still... Let me make sure that it's counting everybody right now. So make sure, yeah, you make sure you comment in there. I have Nightbot open; it is registering you. So make sure you comment in the chat. I have two more rolls for box number one, and let's see here. Armando from the Vault, nice to see you listening tonight. And let's see. Active is subjective. <laughs> As <laughs> long as you comment within the last six minutes before we pull the name, you're considered active in the chat. And we have one more roll left of box number one. Let's see if we can grab a DDO. Come on, we need a DDO, nope. No dice on that one. Sweet, active, and not asleep. That's good. That is good. I wish it was a DDO, but it wasn't. 
It wasn't. Hopefully we'll get one before the night is over, though. I want to find another one so we can give another one away. I have a lot of them. So it would be nice to give one away if we find one. All right. For watch hours, I, ha I heard you have to comment within every five minutes to be counted. I've never heard that, but I mean, I'm not as up to date on all the rules. But I don't think you have to comment every five minutes. I think that if you leave your computer running and then it just sits there for hours and hours and hours on a channel, um, they may not count that because... Um, because it's obvious that someone just left the, the thing running. I think uh, JW's Coins and Hobbies told me that one time. So how many silvers have you found tonight? None yet, Armando from the vault. None yet. But let's go ahead. Littlest Helper, you want to go ahead and roll it? Looks like we have pretty much everybody eligible. The mouse is right there. You can go ahead and roll it. You know how to do it. And Darren L. Allen. Oh, good job. You win, Daryl L. Allen. You win the pair of 1965 Kennedys. Um, congratulations. Email me at RobinHoodCoins at Yahoo.com. And let me know your YouTube channel name. I'll connect your email with your YouTube name. And um, I'll send you a link to claim the prize. So that is one of two active chat giveaways. Well, hopefully we have more because if we find some silver, we'll be giving away some more. <laughs> Just W. No, not that button. <laughs> Desert Racer 954 says, My oldest was a 1934 Wheat Scent, 1935 Buffalo Ender. Nice. All right, let's get back over here to this view and let's get cracking. Find some silver. We need some silver. Yeah, we yeah. do. You gonna help me read the, the comments there, Little Soper? Yeah. Thank you. You're such a good reader, I appreciate it. Yeah. Good practice for you too. Got school starting soon. I'm all right. Thanks, DNH. Is oh. DNH here tonight? Didn't notice. But if you are, good to see you. We have Tracy Bird here. Why is there a coin shortage? I'm not 100% sure. I think there's a couple reasons for it. Nancy, Barbara, we want some silver. Yes, we do. We want some silver. We are going to find some silver. And, uh, and um, Ed, you are pretty close to completing um, your congratulations of half after 20, 2002. Adam and... You said, uh, are you pretty close to completing your collection of halves after 2002? Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure that I have all of them, actually. Um, I think if there's anything I'm missing, it might be a 2019 Philadelphia. And I think maybe my 17s and 18 Philadelphias might be a little low. Nancy Barber, no shortage, no shortage really. Thank you. 
Yeah, it's weird. It's there's definitely some banks that um, are bigger, are more saying there's a shortage than other banks. That's for sure. Because I see Rob Vines Treasure still getting boxes. Um, I'm still getting boxes of half dollars from um, Bank of America. Haven't tried the other denominations yet. Okay. I still have some in reserves, and I've been wanting to. I, I don't like to keep too much cash at the house, so I've been wanting to trim down what I have here at the house. So Daddy. I have um, I have a couple. Wait. I'm doing fine, but have to go. We'll De see you later. D D N H. D N H. I'm doing fine, but I um, but have to have to go. Well, I, well, we'll see you later. Sheree Ward. She's Sheree. talking to Sheree Ward. Banks, her shortage, no hoarding. Yeah. Well, I have a very close friend that works for Brinks, and um, he was saying that um, he is listing off like what he's allowed to drop off at the banks, and by brand, he's allowed to drop off at least one of every denomination to every branch, but they don't always order it. But he did say that, that they're not supposed to or deliver two or more to certain banks. But there was one bank, I think it was called like the Friendly Bank or something. It's in a kind of a rural area here in Texas. And he delivered um, 45 boxes in one day. They have no restrictions on that particular brand of bank. Spooter Doggy, you are right. He did get some boxes. Um, and and he, he actually, I don't know if he went out there a second time, but I know that he got some of those boxes the first time that he met up with um, one of his subscribers who had um, some extra half dollar boxes. That's how he got those um, Arkansas half dollar boxes. JW's Coins and Hobbies said Friendly Bank. Not my bank. Oh, no. Oh, I didn't even notice. Strop, the, the new um, subscriber to the channel, is the stream boss. Took JW out. Just noticed that. Hopefully, we can find some silver here. <laughs> JW's coins and hobbies. You want to get rid of some boxes? Let me know. You know, I I I have thought of. I have thought of that. But actually, so I have about um. I have about I don't know three boxes of dimes. Oh, look at that! Some a stickerized coin that someone butchered. Oh, man. Battle of Gettysburg, it looks like it said at one point. That is a shame. I love the stickerized coins. We have two of them. We have two of them. Uh, I actually sent one back. It was my first or second box that I ever hunted. And, and I was like, what the heck is this sticker on a coin? Like, like, and so I, I sent it back, not realizing. Now I would have kept it. You going to help read the chat there, little helper? Elvis, nice. 
And then read a silver hair seeker's comment. Can you read it there, little silver? <laughs> I tried to swap my a box of quarters for a box of half and a bank. They said I needed a quarter, but I can't order half. Oh, that's no good. But what is it? <laughs> and they and they said they needed the quarters but can't order halves. Yeah. I don't know, man. It's tough. It is tough. Good evening, party people. Good evening, Can Can Collectibles. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. We are going through our second box. We're about 20% of the way through. And after this, we have a box of yellow Loomis rolls that I'm excited to get into. What about uh, Reed Galactic Coin Stackers there, Little S. Helper? She keeps getting sidetracked with that iPad. I need to take that iPad away. No thanks. Uh, Galactic Coin Stacker says, I had a bigger ice hat and one I tried to catch it because they couldn't tell me what the coin was. Is that the one? Yeah. Oh. It's so convenient that U.S. copper nickel coins have brown edges. It is. It makes it very easy to spot the silver. And we found we found our fair share of silver. So the little helpers are getting pretty good at identifying. Wait, Lee Connor Scratcher. Hey, how's it going? How's it going, Lee County Scratcher? Hope you're doing good tonight. Read some more, Littlest Helper. Um, Tracky Bird. I I go to the car wash and get forty bucks in quarters. End up with Susan B. Oth Otherly, otherly, and nineteen sixty four quarters. Pretty cool. That is very cool. That is very cool. I'd love to find 1964 quarters at the car wash. I know JW had some good um, some good luck at the car wash getting quarters as well. How many how many West points did you find that way, JW? Pretty sure you at least found one. Thought you found more though. What? Classic coin, coin stacker. I had to sit in my car for 20 minutes peeling off the stickers so they wouldn't take it. Oh, because they wouldn't take it because the sticker was on it? Maybe that's how the sticker gets peeled off is when someone's trying to cash it in and they're refusing it. Every time I've went, I've found a West Point. Wow. That is awesome. Didn't you go one time and you got stuck with a bunch of tokens, though? Or was that a different, a different uh, car wash? No silver yet. Come on, silver. I know, Katmanduism. I know. I am saying the same thing. I am right there with you. Oh, so we're here in Seeker. I got the um, stash of 500 and quarters. All came from laundry coins, machine, machines. No silver. One S3W, one proof. Nice. Look, okay, it was a proof. I know. That's really good. So with the laundry mat coins 
and I guess the car wash coins too. Um, do those just get recycled there at the location? I mean, obviously, unless the the customer takes them home. But assuming the customer doesn't take them home, they change ten dollars. They stick it in the machine. And the owner just takes it out of the machine and puts it back into the change machine, right? Oh, wait. Mike Nogger Podcast? Mike, um, NH Gold Prospector. Uh, but he says, haven't found a West Point yet. Just a few 2020s. Yeah, keep looking. You you should find some West Points. Um, now they've, they've been out long enough to wear... They, they spread across um, a lot more parts of the U.S. I'm hearing people that, that weren't finding them last year that are starting to find some. Oh, wait, J.W. Coins and Hobbies. Robin and Coins, from the videos I've seen, the owners just put the coins back in the, in the machine until they're full. Yeah, that's what I thought. So the coins just get recycled and recycled and recycled. <laughs> That's why I get a couple hundred at a time. Make them reorder. That is funny. That is great. Yep, keep reading those. You're doing a good job reading the comments, Little Helper. Garrett M. Gun hunting the dimes, no silver. Oh, sorry about that, Garrett M. Sorry about that. The flying Twinkie. I have, I've not found a single W quarter. Well, I hope you find some soon. Lance laughing, lagging, lagging. They're recycling them here only way they can get them. Wait, silver hair seeker, flappy. They're going from the washer and dryers back into the dog change. Yep. Yeah, that's what I figured. For JW Coins and Hobbies, hello, littlest helper. Excuse me? He says it in one single word. So easily entertained. W quarter so far. Which design was it, Adam in? JW coins. After um be after um Adam ends JW coins and hobby. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh jeez, the closest laundry to me is killing me. This week, he's changing the machines from coins to tap cards. Oof. Wait. Jay w. That is no good. J.W. Coins and Hobbies. Mwahahaha. Larry's Randomness, how are you doing tonight? I hope you are doing well. That is a Lance, um, Lance riding. The, the wife has to raid a laundry mat on the quarters for his gas station. The wife has to raid the laundry mat huh. to get quarters for the gas station. Oh, man. Talk on D, no silver. Not yet. Not yet, Tomic D. But we still have half the box left, and we have one more box after that. Jan Lewis says, I have found one West Point and got the other through trade, the other four through trades. Jan Lewis, how did you find one West Point? Did you get rolls from the States or come to the States? 
We have a coin shortage over here in, in Jan Lewis, uh, coin roll hunting American coins in Canada. All right, hopefully we can get some silver. You gonna read some more there, yeah. little Liz Helper? Yep. Um, wait, Jan Lewis, I was in the U.S. when I found it. Oh, that's, that's what I kind of figured, but Daddy? that's some good luck. You go to the U.S., you find a, you find a West Point. Um, Daddy, Ooh, look at this, everyone. This is either a fat 1980 or 79. Or you did press something. There you go. Oh, thank you. Or it could be a proof. Nope. It's just a... Oh, a 1999. Normally it's like a 79 or an 81 when they're real thick and shiny like that. But that is just a 1999. I have $400 US here, but the border is closed yet. Yeah. You... Someone was telling me that, that um, workers can't even get across. Like there's some miners um, that can't get across to Canada to work because of the whole borders being closed. Hmm. Gonna party like it's 1999. That is right. What? Adam and war is war in the Pacific. War in the Pacific. I like that design. That is one of my favorite designs. Wait, Nancy Barry, that that's what they are trying to do. Going from money to cards. Cards. Yeah, they're trying to switch from money to cards. Even that, or, or the other thing I've seen them do is the tokens. Because you're, you're less likely to have people take the tokens and spend them elsewhere because they're not worth anything anywhere else. Atomic D and NIFC is not intended for circulation. It's uh, coins that uh, were sold to collectors and not intended to be uh, um, in circulation at the banks. Yeah, I did. I'm scrambled. Let's get that silver. Chad Schmitz, let's get that silver. Yes, yes, yes. Um, token D, that was an NIFC. Yes, it was. Right there. I will update the board probably after this box. Wait, Chad, Um, Brooks, I, le I uh, live in Texas and still haven't found a W. Carl's Coins, good luck. Hope you find some silver. I need to run and record my podcast. Cheers. Cheers to you too, Carl's Coins. Good luck with your podcast. Is that so, Mike? Thank you for the silvery wishes right there. I appreciate it. Really do appreciate it. That's what I'm saying. Let's get some silver. Well, we are over halfway through this box. Flying Twinkie Wait. says, are we on the RFT bank box yet? No, we are Wait. not. Um, NIFC, Dan Lewis says, NIFC means not intended for circulation. This includes years 1970, 1987, and... 
2002. The nearer half dollars, 1987, were only recently for collected, not in terms of relation that year. That's right. Mission Get Rich. Hey guys, sorry I'm late. Just walked in the door from vacation. Nice. Hope everyone is having a great day. Well, where did you go for vacation? And I hope you had a great time. Token D, so we're at the halfway point. Uh, we're actually past the halfway point. We are at roll 29. And actually, this is roll number 30 right here. Hello, see, see your, hello, uh, hello, mission get rich. SpaceX just did the first test flight of one of their Starship rockets, which is part of their Humans to Mars plan. I thought I saw an article about that, so I'm assuming the test went okay. I haven't seen any major headlines saying otherwise. Time to start playing with hammers in the garage. We'll be listening. Good stuff. Good. Stamp out those... Silver bars. Are you doing? Uh, are you doing more of the uh, the hammered bar that you posted onto Instagram? There will never be humans on Mars, Lance Lodig says. People running away from the current situation. <laughs> They're like. Hopefully that virus ain't in Mars. I'm doing one hammered bar tonight. Unless I get froggy, then I might melt more. Never know what can happen. <laughs> uh, let's see. Not yet, Katmanduism. Not finding much of anything yet. But we still got one more box, and all it takes is one box to change your luck. Oh, uh, Mikey Platt. Hello, everyone. Sorry, I'm back now. Well, welcome back. Welcome back. I have a small beach house on the Lake Erie by Cedar Point and Putin Bay. It's all by itself, so no one around with a, a private beach. It's nice. That would be nice. That would be nice. Peace and quiet. That would be great. I do not like peace and quiet. I think all of the bickering and people people being judgy of, over other people and their actions. I don't know. It's starting to wear me down. Just everyone be nice. In the water. I know. Thankfully, our pool is finally open. But we cannot go tonight. No. Nope. But we can go in the morning, Mom said. Let's see. I looked up, it went up 150 meters and then landed this up. Oh. Well, at least it landed itself and it was safe. And no one got hurt. It's a good thing. <laughs> Galactic Coin Stacker says, I don't know, does China own Mars yet? That is funny. All right, everyone. We have got to find some silver. Yeah, we do. We do. When we get to the next box, are you going to want to open some rolls? Um, Maybe just get us started and yeah. get the silver going and then yeah. let me find the rest. Mission Get Rich. Has my package came yet? 
Yes, um, I actually picked up your package, uh, Mission Get Rich, as well as the package from Silver Hair Seeker um, a couple of days after I filmed the last mail call. So, uh, the next mail call will have both of you guys' packages in the mail call. And thank you both, by the way, for sending that. I look forward to opening it up. And then Silver Hair Seeker, did you um I thought you I thought you might have said something about some turquoise or or some kind of stones. Um but then I think it was last week we were chatting on the live stream. And someone, either you or someone else, might have said that they're not necessarily the best for tumbling. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> thanks for a box of rocks. Hey, those box of rocks, I was planning on tumbling, but I just didn't know. I think someone said that they might not be the best for tumbling, but I want to tumble them. I figured that would be our first, uh, our first project okay awesome just wanted to make sure it came since I had problems with the first one yeah no and I really appreciate it um, sorry you had to send it twice man sorry you had to send it twice Brad Kearney I've tried to teach my boys to be humble and nice but there's a lot of obstacles yeah, there is. These days, with all the different drama that's out there. I mean, I'm not going to get on to the, to the whole COVID situation and my personal views on it. But, the one thing I will say, no matter what side of the fence you're on, is you shouldn't make other pe people feel bad if they have a different view. And that's what we see a lot of here. Like, there's some people that, um, that Maid Marian saw at the pool, and they were saying that uh, some parents that opted for virtual school are going to go to the school when it opens to protest the people that are in school, even though they got their kid to be virtual. And so they're literally just protesting because other people didn't choose the same thing. And I'm just like, man, what does this world come to? I would just be happy that I live in a country, in a town that offered both, and I get to choose what's right for my family, and others get to choose what's right for theirs. But that's enough of that soapbox. I don't know anything about tumbling rocks and stones. I can polish your brass, but rocks know it. No expectations. Can you tumble glass? Glass? I don't know. I know, Flying Twinkie. It is pretty rough. But, children need social skills. I agree. Our daughters are begging for it. I mean, you guys could see just from the videos and the, the live streams how outgoing they are. They've never met a stranger ever before. We're in line at the grocery store and they're chatting it up with the people in front of us and behind us. So being stuck at home has been rough for them. But... It'll get better tonight whenever the little helper, the littlest helper here, finds us some silver, huh? If I do. If you do. I'm a COVID-19 nurse. It's crazy out there. Peace to all. Yes, thank you. Peace to all. And thank you for everything you're doing, Tracy Bird. Really appreciate it. Really, really, really appreciate it. I know how to throw rocks. <laughs> Jan Lewis says, I know how to throw rocks. 
That is good stuff. You're not reading, little helper. You can do glass in salt water for sea glass look. Mm. See, she answered your question and you weren't reading it. I was a gunsmith and commercial reloader for 30 years. I know how to polish guns and brass for reloading. No glass. Gotcha. You gonna read some more the little this helper? Dan Erica says, politics suck. I come in here to get away from all that. I know. So we'll stop talking about it there, Dan Erica. I tried to avoid it, and I apologize for bringing it up. I don't... I apologize for bringing it up. So, let's switch the subject to... Does anyone... Is, has anyone had any good um, metal detecting finds over the past week? Has anyone found any good metal detecting finds? Or is it just too hot? Too hot to metal detect? I could totally get that too. It is pretty hot here. Pretty, pretty hot. Come on, silver. Yeah, Brad Kearney, I get it. Too hot here, too. Maybe not too hot, but it is pretty hot. Too hot for me to be metal detecting anyway. <laughs> a flying Twinkie, but don't have a metal detector either. Yeah, it'd be kind of hard to metal detect without one. Kind of hard. 1956 Washington Quarter in Florida, and yes, it was hot. Well, congratulations, Jason. That is awesome. That would be awesome to find silver in the ground. That would be great. Want to buy a new ace? Just some old brass rifle shells. Gonna try in the mountains this week. Oh, we're getting close, Robert Mims. The next box is the one that uh, I was hopeful for. We only have three rolls left, including this one of the last NF String and Sons, and then we're getting into the Loomis box is coming. Yeah, I bet you there's always a lot of people on the beach metal detecting Silver Hair Seeker. That would make sense. Rob finds treasure found another V nickel. That is great. That is awesome. Yeah, I I don't know if it's the coin shortage or like people being out of work and maybe cashing in some stuff, but I felt like uh, the, the box of nickels that you guys are going to see on Thursday was one of the better boxes that I've had in a long time. Um, besides half dollars, I have felt like the boxes have been pretty fruitful lately. Which is exciting. I got to go through some more. So this is the last roll 
of the NF String and Sons. And then we're going to crack into the Yellow Loomis Uh, magnet fishing is a real kick in the pants, so you should try it. That does. I have a thought about that one. Um, and all you gotta do is buy the magnet and the rope. I mean, it's not even like a huge investment, right? Um, can can collectibles found six 2020 W Salt River Bay quarters. So Salt River Bay West points are out, huh? Did not know that. Wow. That is cool. Hopefully I can get some boxes and I can get a brand new box out of that. That would be awesome. My local beaches are cleaned by tractor every night. You wouldn't believe the treasure those guys get during the summer months. Yeah, I know. I bet you they do get a lot of great stuff. All right. So I'm going to open up the uh, night bot again. And we are going to do another giveaway. This time it is going to be for, it's kind of slick, it's a 1907 Barber Half Dollar right there. Minted in San Francisco. You know I always look for those San Francisco's. Those and the other, the other one I really like is the New Orleans. Probably just because I don't, it's so much more uncommon. But uh, if you want to be eligible in that giveaway, just comment in the chat. And I'm going to get a fresh box for my coin. Right there. Commence RFT chat. <laughs> this is what it looks like, huh? RFT's chat, when it's slow, it's moving faster than this. It's one of the reasons why I don't comment much. It's because it's just going so fast. All right, everybody, good luck. And I am going to go ahead and we'll double check it real quick. Make sure that everyone is in. Looks like we have almost everybody. Good, good, good. Let's go ahead and roll it. Catmanduism. That is awesome. Catmanduism. Congratulations. You win the 1907 Barber right here. And right there, uh, email me at robinhoodcoins at yahoo.com and, and let me know your channel name and I will send you that link so you can claim your prize. Congratulations, Katmanduism. All right. So, the other thing I need to do, oh, you know what, let's update the board real quick. Let's update the board, it'll just take a second. So, we had, we have seven NIFC so far. Seven NIFC, there we are. Now it's time for the Yellow Loomis box. This is the box we've been waiting for. So. And I think it's got a decent amount of glue. I can see it spilling out. Yeah. All right, I figured what I would do, if it'll fit, uh, nope, I don't see any enders. We are just going to rip off the flaps.
and we're just gonna put it on there and we're gonna go through it. All right, here we go. There we go. Let me show everybody right there. Does not look like we have any enders on that side. Oh, you know, I can't help it. I do really want to see if we have any enders though. Does anyone remember on Friday night if the box that had 20 silver had any enders? Does anyone remember Rob Finds Treasures Friday night box? Just curious. Two enders, Jan Lewitt says. Well, and there is a chance that uh, we may not have any silver. We're just gonna get into there. There was a couple more rolls, but it's just taken a while. I lost my helper to help me film. Did you want to start us off? All right, littlest helper, you gotta bring us some silver luck here. No thinking like that, Nancy Barber said. Yeah, he had two silver enders for sure. I figured probably because when you have 20 silver, you usually have some enders. We will see. Hopefully we find some silver. We got the littlest helper helping us out here. Um, she, no, she's, she's there all the way till 8 o'clock. It's 7.40 right now. Oh. And it's going to take her a little bit to get back home, too. They probably won't be home until about 8.15. I'll probably be in bed at that time. Why do you invest before they come? Uh, no. Yeah. All right, little helper, let's get some silver. Hopefully we can still find ourselves a DDO before the night is over. You almost thought you found one? Yeah. Yeah, you had to check it, double check it. All right, interesting spectrum of answers. Want to use a screwdriver? No. I like my nails. You like using your nails. All right. Hope for the little helper right here and get the silver flowing. I can only get the silver if I can open it. Guys, please say some jokes. Jokes. <laughs> you want some jokes? Jokes. I think they might be all joked out. Like, 
Man, they were giving so many jokes last week. No jokes out. They might have ran out of jokes. How do you know? I don't know. <laughs> we're like a hive of bees. When we hear a giveaway, we get excited and start swarming around the comment section. <laughs> Bring on that silver. We're all watching. I know. You are welcome, Katmanduism. You are very, very welcome. And if we don't have any silver, then we won't be able to give away silver. I know. we got to find some silver so we can give some away. Nope. we got to find some. And plus, I like my hands because then they won't die me. You know what else I'm hoping to find on this stream? It would be fine to it would be fun to find a magic coin on the live stream. It's pretty hard to use my my phone now because like Mike Pallet, I agree. Come on, silver. We want silver now. Yes, we do. <laughs> oh, the trash is this way, right here. All right. Human nature. Why was Tiger... Why was Tigger looking in the toilet? Uh, I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> Jose, you're... Why? Why was Tigger looking in the toilet? We do not know. What is the answer? It's kind of hard to use like my thumbnails because I should kind of bend it forward. You could use the... And I like you. It's Jasmine. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he was looking for poo. <laughs> he was looking in the toilet for poo. That's funny. Come on, little helper. Little helper, you're supposed to find us some silver. Maybe my sister. But maybe daddy finds me silver. I know. Or maybe Claire does. Oh, she's my the little helper, you mean? Yeah. My five-year-old told me that. <laughs> Oh, Lord. Let's see. How can you tell the ocean is friendly? Um, it has friendly creatures. Because it waves. <laughs> <laughs> you like that one? Yeah, I was going to play that one. Your little helper? Because, like, the waves make the wave and it's, like, waving to you. All right. Well, this is a good sign. We, I see it right here coming. We have a couple really nice NIFCs all back to back. What's wrong with your, did you break your nail? Kind of. A little, because, like, it's, like, sticking out. You could use the screwdriver. I do not like to. Yeah, yeah. Looks like we got, and then a 2017. So yeah. sometimes where there is NIFCs, there is silver. Yeah, yeah. I can open these things like a pro with my fingers. Yes, you can. Let's see if there's any other jokes in there. I'd love Black to see that happen. Paper cuts A magic coin. That would be fun. Wait, don't we have a magic coin? We do have a magic coin, but I just think it would be fun to find one on the live stream. Ooh. I want to use that magic coin thing. Yeah. I just think it would be fun to find one. Me too.
This is the last row, and I'm gonna let my daddy do some more. You're gonna let me do some more? Yep. That's nice of you. Uh, nope. That's it. So hopefully these NIFCs that we found right here. Where's the magic coin though? Uh, don't get it out. Oh. Okay. Uh, A real fr red frosty's joke. Come on, random walker. I know. That's what I'm talking about. Let's just get that random. Walking Liberty out of nowhere, just saying, hello. Here you go. You were asking for silver, and now you get a random walker. The walker is hiding. We need to find it. That is what I'm talking about. That would be great. When you find a magic coin, how do you know it's a magic coin? Uh, like, does it feel different? It sounds different. They are hollow, uh, so you can tell the sound of the coin. It sounds hollow, and so it's pretty distinct. You can tell the difference pretty easily in all the ones that I have found anyway. We found a couple of them on our videos. Not too many though. I think I've only found two or three so far in our coin roll hunting videos. Do you know how to catch a unique rabbit? Unique up on it. Uh, JC likes Pam. We'll have to share that one with the girls once they get back. Lost a little as helper. Don't know exactly where she went. Oh, she's getting a drink, she says. Jan Lewitt, that's a good one. They, they got several uh, jokes for you in here. Yeah, when she gets back, we'll have her read off some of the jokes. We got a 2009 NIFC. Now we just need to find the silver friends that hopefully are with it. Um, Jan Lewitt, uh, he gave you a couple jokes. Mm -hmm. You want to read it? No, I would like you to read other read us the joke. Jan Lewitt says, what did the banana say to the dog? Um, don't eat me. <laughs> uh, nothing. Bananas don't talk. Um, then he said, what do you call a sleeping dinosaur? Um, snore? D uh, dinosnore. <laughs> and then, um, JC likes Pam. Where is that at? Uh, where'd they go? Where did they go? There it is. My dad scrawled and says, such a good dad, though. Say what? Said, such a good dad. Dad. And then, um, JC Likes Pam says, do you know how to catch a unique rabbit? Um, no. Unique up on it. <laughs> like you sneak up on it? I get it. You get it, good. All right. I'm glad you get it. I don't get it. Oh man, the silver is still hiding. We have got. I wish that there was a thing called um a um a silver walker and a silver Benji. That would be great. 
<laughs> what do you call Robin Hood toy, uh, coins steak dinner? Robin Hood loins. That is funny. Okay. I did not get it. <laughs> uh, everyone, what do we got to do to get the silver to start flowing? How did you get the camera to show on the microscope? What do you mean? Like, um, like, on this, like, the computer to show the microscope. Oh, it's mean? just part of the computer, the program. Huh. Part of the program. Everything cool. Unique up on it. Yeah. Come on, everyone knows it's a snore, snore a serious. The jokes will give us, uh, luck. The jokes will give us luck, you think? I know. You know, all right. I like I like your I like the you know better. It's, okay. Call that shot. Let's get some silver. I know. I think it will give some silver. 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 Let's see. Not a joke, but a pig cannot look up at the sky. I did not realize. Is that true? Pigs cannot look up? Pigs cannot look up. I thought it was a T-Rest. Oh, like a T-Rex. That is good stuff. Good, good stuff. Come check this out, little helper. Littlest helper. Uh, uh, what is it? What is it? Look. Hmm? Look right here. I can see it. There might be a silver. And it's a beautiful 1965. I knew the joke would give us luck. That is good stuff. With a 2017 Ender right there, a nice looking one. Oh, that is great. We did find silver. That's a nice one too, look at that. It's a pretty good reflection. It's got some nice, nice reflection. I don't, I don't know if it's an SMS, I don't, I don't think so. But, just good that we found silver. Let's find some more. Boom. Looks like silver, 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 everyone is saying. Why do porcupines always win the game? Because they have the most points. Because they're porcupines and they have points. I get it. <laughs> OMG, she says. Oh. Oh, I am glad that we found some silver, is what Daddy is saying. Gosh. It's like pulling teeth. But, now that we got some, let's get some more. Wait, I know what um, um, OMG stands for. Um, let's see, I wonder if we have any other... Nice job, Littlest Helper. I know what um, OMG stands for. Ocean, Molar, um, and the G stands for Google. Oh. <laughs> update the board. Okay. You are right, fill the board. You are right, fill the board. Let's update it. So we now have bunch of NIFCs. That's seven. So 12. So right there. Let's see. And we'll get that 40 percenter. So board is updated. Now let's find some more. Yeah. Let's find some more silver. That's what I'm talking about, huh? Yeah, we did. Oh, yep. Look at that. Wait, what? 
It is a DDO 1974 double to die up burst. You can tell. It is pretty slick, but look at that. You can see the two split serifs at the top of the U. You see the line down that R right there. The 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 split on the four is the dead giveaway. And let's see if we can get a second. Nope. Not on that one. Let's see. Oh. Holy cannoli chicken burgers, Brooks VP says. <laughs> Robert Mims, that is great. Uh, littlest helper. Robert Mims says, what do you call a cold dog? A chili dog. Chili, like, like cold, like it's chili in here? Because it's cold? I get it. You get it now? <laughs> All right. I thought it was funny. And also... Uh, Jan this, Lewitt. This is the drink I was getting. Sunny D. Sunny D. They like their Sunny D. Jan Lewitt says, what did the pencil say to the paper? Or, what did the paper say to the pencil? Right on. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> right, it means it's like right on the paper. Exactly. <laughs> Catmanduism, I wish it was a uh, SMS. I wish it was a better way to tell. I have a couple coins that I really think are SMSs, and I just. Yep, the wrappers say Loomis on them if they're Loomis. And they're also a different color. And the other ones just say half. Let's see if we can find us some more silver. We are uh, one away. We're on roll 24 right here. Try to lick your elbow. Hmm? I try to lick your head elbow. Because he says it's physically impossible. Which I don't doubt. Daddy, I do not think that's physically impossible. I think that you think you can? Well, try it. Try to lick your elbow. You let us know if you're able to lick your elbow. <laughs> Come over here and show everybody. <laughs> she might prove you wrong. <laughs> she came close. But she didn't do it. Licking my elbow is easy for sure. How does a train eat? Um, I'm steaming out and then for the air. It goes choo choo. That's why I thought at first I was like, uh, <laughs> You should have said it. it. How does it eat like that? Oh, well, that's funny. All right, we're on roll 26 here, and let's get more of that silver going. More of the silver. Need to find more. Hit that like button. That would be great. Thank you, Jan. Appreciate it. 
This 2017 looked like an ass. No, it was a Denver. Sorry, it's super shiny. But it is a Denver. And we're going to get into roll number 27 right here. 27. Shooting for some silver. Shooting for the silver. Got to find just a couple more. And then a couple more after that. And then more and more and more. Yeah. You know the drill, little helper. You know the drill. And then even more and even more and even more and even more. I had a bee get in my wine bottle, and when I drank from it, I got a fat lip. Oof. <laughs> that would not be fun. A fat lip? Well, yeah, because a bee got in her wine bottle, and then when she drank out of it, the bee stung her. Oh. Yeah, that's no bueno. That is no good. Let's see if we can't find ourselves. Nope, no video. No video. All right. Let's see. We still have 21 more rolls to go. Check that out. That's interesting. 575 in like little hole punches. Interesting little coin there. It's a lot of effort to put all those little holes in the coin. Someone must have been really bored. Hey, check it out. Roll number 30. We put a thousand strings in almost a thousand strings. Roll number 30 right here. But they're not actually real holes because look. There you look. They almost look. Well, yeah, they're not like holes all the way through, but they are still kind of like little holes. But that is crazy. I know. That is pretty crazy, isn't it? Why do birds fly south? No, nope, they fly south in the winter. Why do they fly south? They fly south so that they can, uh, because south, they, it's a warmer place. You are right. They do fly south because it's warmer. But yeah. Jen Lewis says it's because it's too far to walk. <laughs> I can't because you said fly there. <laughs> No, these holes are not Sharpie. They are holes. Yeah, you can see... Okay, now. Where's my sister going to be? If this is what you're talking about, I had those marks on some of my coins. They were just Sharpie. No, but these are not. These are holes. I don't think I have a needle here. Otherwise, I'd stick it in one of the holes. We do it. We have two pigs. Yeah. No DVO. We'll keep on trying. We still have 19 rolls left. Let's get another silver. Uh, Jan Lewitt, I think it says 575. I mean, I'm assuming that's what that is. But uh, crazy, some guys mark, some guys mark so he knows they are bad coins. 
They're all my 72S, I think. Oh, look at that. I was busy looking at the chat. That is great. Oh, that is great. We have another one. Or S75, Brooks says. Brooks VP. Look at that, everybody. Look at that. We got two on the board. Two on the board right there. San Francisco from 1975, maybe. But we have two silver on the board. Ladies and gentlemen. Yay! I know, I'm saying yay too. Hopefully we can find some more. Then say yay. 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 I know. A couple people were saying too that we needed to find some silver and we have. We have. Now we just need fill the board to give us some luck on a 90 and a proof. A 90 and a proof. A 90 and a proof. Or a proof 90. That'd be cool. That would be really cool. Take care of two birds with one stone. Yeah, it would also be cool to give away. It would be cool to give away. I don't think I've found a silver proof yet. Oh, look at this. That's probably just an 80s. Yep, that 88. Fat, shiny rim. Let's see. A 90 proof. Yeah, that's, a, that's what I said there, Nancy Barber. Uh, great minds think alike. Great minds think alike. Maybe we can see the holes under the scope. Oh, that's a good idea. That is a good idea. Look at that. I think you can see like the, the ridges of where the metal was kind of lifted on the edge. And there's the hole in the bottom. I'm, I'm kind of tilting it because it looks all dark when you're at this angle. But if you kind of tilt it, you can see the light that's hitting the, the very bottom of the pit in some of them. Good idea. Need a proof. Proof 90. Actually, I do think I have found a proof 90. It was, um, it's one of the 40, no, I've never found a proof 90. I did find a 40% proof though. I was looking in my, um, in my half dollar album in that, that first page, the Kennedy album, and I did see a proof in there. And I've only put coins that I have found, nothing that's purchased in that folder. So, I have found a proof 40, but never found a proof 90. And they did make them. I want to say it's like in the 90s and in the 2000s, the NIFCs. Some of them have uh, some of them have 90% proofs. So, Littlest Helper, Dad, can you put my shoes on? Robin Hood, no, I don't think they'll fit me. <laughs> I have I have said stuff like that to them sometimes when they word their question incorrectly. They get all frustrated. That's a good one though, Robert Mims. You know what the little helper gets all bent out of shape on? Is if she says, I'm hungry, and I tell her, nice to meet you, hungry, how are you doing? My name's TJ. Oh, she gets so angry. My name is Dorothy. Oh, look at that one. 
That is a nice one. Philadelphia 2016. Beautiful. That is a really nice one. So we're up to 14 of the NIFCs. I'll update the board in a little bit. I will update the board in a little bit. Got to see if we have some more videos. But we don't. But we don't. Jen Lewitt did your emoji. <laughs> My emoji. That is a keeper, Robert Mims. That is a keeper. That's the other thing that um, I ordered is a box of BCW tubes for half dollars. So my wife's going to be sorting out all of my NIFCs. I'll put a couple of sets of those on my website in case anyone needs them for their album. I saved, so far I save all of the NIFCs that are in good condition. And I got a lot. I think just this year I've found five or six hundred NIFCs. Mike Collett says, I have a 1968 silver proof half dollar. That might be the year that I have as well. I believe so, actually, because it's either a 68 or 69 because um, the, the 65 through 67 were just SMSs, I believe, weren't they? Someone will probably correct me if I'm wrong. Come on, we need some more silver. Yeah, we do. More silver. More silver. <laughs> Come on, do her, making her do maids work. Yep, Maid Marion is my organizing queen. I like searching for coin more than I like organizing it. I like looking at the collections when they're organized. And I like searching for it, but I don't like organizing it. Is that why she does it? Yeah, that's why she helps. I also got my book, um, for my album for walkers. And I need more giveaways for the channel. So I have a roll of walkers that I bought in Little Rock and a roll of Mercury Dimes. And we're going to go through those together. Ooh. And then the duplicates I'll be giving away on the channel. Time to update the board. You are right. We have two silver, not one. And 14 NIFCs, not 12. And we are working on roll number 40 right here. 41, sorry. This is roll 41. And I think I updated it too soon. We got another beautiful 2016 right there. Let's see. Let's see what we can get. Oh, we need to get another 1973 DDO. That is what I'm talking about. You need a miscellaneous for things like that strange coin. Yeah, I thought about it. I might just add a miscellaneous in there. Um, that's what I'm talking about. That is what I am talking about. I get the silver. You tell me. I don't know. Did we find one? I think we did. 
Yeah, yeah, hold it like that. let's let the camera, let the color normalize. There you go. 1968 Denver. Let's see if we have a repunch mint mark. Nope. That is pretty clean mint mark, in fact. 1968 Denver, right there. Oh, that is great. Sounds like we got the uh, Little Helper and Maid Marion back. I hear them in the background. Updating gives luck confirmed. Oh, <laughs> uh, you know what? Just because you said that, we're going to go ahead and update again. Maybe you are right. We still need we still need that proof ninety. We need the proof ninety. Nice, Catman Duism says. I'm go yeah, Nancy Barber. I know. I heard you guys. Hey, I'm back. But Claire, we find more than one silver. Little helper. Uh, Lance Lodic says I'm back. Just closed the deal on a batch of MS buffaloes. Nice. Hey, Mint Hunter. State Buffaloes. How was it? Well, um, I didn't really flip. I did flip on the bars. Uh, it, it what? Yeah. Hi. We found silver while you were gone. Mm hmm I heard that you found... I think it's 64. Wait, the silver No, it's 65, a 67, and a 68. What's the one that you just found? The 68. Okay. Wait. Okay. But we got some tacos. Oh, you got some tacos? Uh-huh. Taco. All right. We got some tacos, and guess what? All right, we updated the board, so hopefully that is going to give us some luck. Some silvery luck. We got another nice 2016. But it was very fun. So much fun. You had fun at your gymnastics class? <laughs> that is good stuff. So Chloe sent me jokes. Oh yeah, they did start telling some jokes. I want to hear one. I want to hear one. Can you guys call me a joke? I really want to hear a joke. JW's Coins and Hobbies says, Boss, get to work. Me. I've been here all morning. <laughs> Alright, no DDO, but... Oh. Uh, What's up? <laughs> Nothing. I was just... I'm, I'm just... I'm just getting back into my little perch. She does have a burrito. <laughs> oh, and I have one too. Go eat it. And here's Dixie. Now, trying to be all incognito in the background. Yep, and nothing like your eight year old ratting you out. No joke. Alright, we had six rolls left. Oh, man. Oh, okay. Little helper. Why do birds fly south? Uh, to my day? It's too far to walk. <laughs> 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 I know Galactic Coin Stacker, I know, but we gotta try to keep it keep it as low on the wraps as possible. Um, if you find a 90 proof, we can have a party. I know, Nancy Barber, I know. Alright, where'd that silver coin go? Is the dog a helper too? No, the dog is not a helper. Completely. Not until the little helper teaches the dog how to sniff out silver. Yeah, not... Then she'll be a helper. Yeah, it's a she. What do you call a mat... A mat... A, a magician, magician a that magician? lost his magic. Uh, Magicless magician? Ian. Ian. Because... <laughs> magic, magician, take out magic, what's left? I-A-N. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> no, All right, so 
Alright, I'm gonna go eat. <laughs> Let's do a giveaway and we will do the I told you guys I wanted to give away a DDO. We found this DDO right here. We have a 1967, so we have a silver and a variety. So if uh, if you want to enter this giveaway, all you have to do is comment in the chat, double check the Nightbot, and it is live and going. So all you have to do is comment in the chat if you want to enter a giveaway. We still have six more rolls, but I wanted to give away a 1974 Denver DDO, and we did find one, so that was... Cool. This is a total side note, but I just want you to know that your daughter, before we even got there, she's like, oh, I'm so nervous. Oh, you know, when your stomach starts to feel weird, I have that feeling in my stomach. And then she's telling me how she has to take it easy because her stomach hurts. So just FYI. Great jokes. Now I'm hungry for a taco. I know, train watcher Dawn. I know, I'm hungry too. All right. And then uh, Nancy Barber said, Hi, Maid Marion. Hello. Oh, I just sounded like. Uh, <laughs> sounded all like crazy. Mrs. Doubtfire. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh, geez. Getting a new persona. <laughs> all right, let's go ahead and roll it. Let's see who's going to win this giveaway. <gasps> and what? It is. Tuesday Taco Tuesday. Oh, that's good. Well, and you you Sorry. were channeling your Taco Tuesday. Dan Erica, you win. Dan Erica. And I think you've won before, so you know the drill. Shoot me an email to claim your prize. Congratulations, Dan Erica. You win the silver and the 1974 DDO. Now let's find some more silver to give away. So you, oh, is this the last spot? Yeah. Oh man, talk about a slacker. Meaning me, you know, right? You missed out on and two boxes. But it's all good. She needed to go to her gymnastics. Gotta keep the kids active in sports. Our son was active in sports all the way through senior year. I don't know. I personally feel like it helps keep him out of trouble. Let's get some more silver. Maybe get another DDO while we're at it. That would be great. Not today. Nice oh, giveaway. Man. Peggy Smiths. I should have been Brooks VP, but I wasn't. I was trying to get my exercise in. I was going to. I should have. Should have what? Watch the chat or watch the stream. But you you uh, ran, right? Or walked fast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's all good. The littlest helper was she would she would get up, she would read like a couple comments, and then she would play her game, and then she'd get up and she'd read a couple comments. Yes. So I'm beating the littlest helper at moderating at least. Uh, she was pretty good at reading comments. What? She she was. Are you trying to say I'm not? <laughs> no, not what I'm saying at all. Oh, okay. Come on, you don't guys... ruin the mojo. We were getting silver. Oh, so now it's gonna be my fault, huh? <laughs> gotta change the subject somehow. <laughs> Okay, let's get another DDO then. Let's get another DDO. All right. <laughs> oh, Jan. <laughs> I know, Jan. I got to be careful. 
Gotta be careful. <laughs> oh, we only have two more rolls. We someone wished for silver. Someone wished for silver. Telling everybody that um, I also got half dollar coin roll tubes for you to organize all of our NAFCs. Oh, I did know. Are you sure that were they halves? I thought I saw a dollar. I thought I got it both, but. Oh, maybe you maybe did. Maybe not. Oh, that one almost tricked me. Like, had a lot of silver, but there's copper there. That's. It's a 71. Well, we did find three silver tonight, so that is good. And I was thinking it's good, it could have been one of those boxes because uh, Friday night he found 27. 20 in one box and 7 in the other two. What do cats eat for breakfast? Mice Krispies. Nice. got to tell the girls that one. Does not look like we're gonna get silver in the last roll there, everybody. Does not look like we're gonna have silver in that last roll. We do have some nice 72 and 74 though. So we'll check those out. Did you find any good NIFCs? I did. I did. We found some really nice ones. Some really nice ones. A couple really nice 2004s. But there's one 2016 and 2017 that are just... This 2016 Philly is pretty nice. So, I'll go ahead and update that. Show some final tallies here. Oh, that 16 is nice. Sorry, I'm a little delayed over here. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. You have a little bit of a delay there. A little bit of a delay. Let's see if you can call the little helper. Uh, little helper. Yeah. It is a good box, Jan. Three is a good box. I mean, normally, ha had it not been from the same bank where there was one with 20, like, if it was just a random box that I got with th three, I'd be stoked. And I am pretty happy. I got a joke for you. We got one that we could give away, it. and we have two more to give away on another stream. Oh, sorry. I didn't want to interrupt you, so I didn't run. How do you answer the phone at the paint store? Wait. Use a paint butch? Yellow. <laughs> 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 I don't get it. Hi ho, Silver Show. <laughs> the color? The color yellow paint. Well, like hello, <laughs> yellow. <laughs> All right. Oh. Brad Kearney three is not a lost box. No, it is not. Three is a good box, especially with the DDO and sixteen NIFCs on the night. And some silver. Not bad. Yep, three silver. We will take Wait, that all day four? long. Did we have four? What's the most expensive kind of fish? A goldfish, you got it right. A goldfish. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Wait, that was a joke? Yeah. Oh, I was like, a goldfish. Show <laughs> me Marion the gold. Dottie coin. Oh. Someone like put dots, oh, like wow. holes in it. But I looked at it under the scope too. Those are actual like pinholes. Can I see? But obviously with a, a nail, not a, not a regular pin probably. Oh, yeah. And did you notice on the back, you it's beveled? Like you can see where... Oh, that's a good point. Ooh, I want to see. So on the back, you see the dots. Oh, wow. Well, maybe that's not. Can you see them? Like you could, I don't know if maybe. We... Yeah, yeah, no, that's it right there. Right oh, on yeah, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, right on the side of the, of the wing. Can I see that? It's like right, you can see. Right there. Those are the dots from the. Can I see the front? I want to see the front in person. Whoa. But it kind of looks 
looks like an SS. Uh, it's 757 or S75. I think it's S7S. It could be. Could be. All right, so Gold? tonight's oh. end of stream is from Mrs. His and Hers Coins. Well, His and Hers Coins and Mrs. His and Hers Coins. But uh, I believe their videos are on the His and Hers Coins channel. If you haven't checked them out, please do check them out. Show them some support. They gave us the uh, slab coin for last week's um, end of stream and this week's end of stream. And this week's end of stream is a Proof 69 Deep Cameo George Washington dollar coin. Just beautiful. That thing is awesome looking. Look at that. That is really great. So, um, to enter the... And then Budget Coin Hunter says that's about a $14 slab. That is good stuff. Um, Maid Marion, can you link the comment video for um, the end of stream? Yes, sorry. Sorry, I was off duty. I'm a little rusty. I know. I know. So, um, most of you probably have already commented on the comment video, but um, then JW's Coins and Hobbies says, Ooh, Proof! Did he beat me? Oh, oh. He says, Oh, Jan Lewitt did beat oh. you, though. Yeah, Jan beat you. Oh, <laughs> two comments away. <laughs> oh. It was two comments away? Well, one in between you. Brad, Brad Esta um, oh. put a beautiful coin right in between you. But yeah, he, he beat you. Mm -hmm. I, on my screen, I'm before Brad. That's why I was like, wait, no, I was right after. Oh, yeah, no. So for those of you that haven't, please comment on that real quick. And um, I'll give it a little bit so that way everyone has a chance. Um and then can can collectibles yep budget gold top 2k i know gold top 2k gonna have to start uh finding scrap scrap jewelry gold and refining it gold and then jw's coins and hobbies is put the comment video as well thank you jw jan and maid marion Appreciate it. Time to melt. Well, good luck, JW's Coins and Hobbies. Oh, you, did he say when he's melting? Or he I, I, I believe he's melting silver, probably, but he might be melting something else. He posted a silver melt video, um, and he was selling a bunch of the silver bars and everything. Oh. Um, I didn't watch it until this morning on my run, and so I put in for one of the rounds and he said that uh, they sold out last night to it within two hours wow his car <laughs> oh time to melt gold he said gold that is not tonight for me yeah uh -huh. oh I will check it I will check it the the hammered ones aren't aren't my favorite. Um, I like them for the art that they are, but um, you like it all smooth and yeah. I'll show you. I'll show you what the hammered look looks. Um, it's cool. Um, but he has he has his JW um, his other channel is his JW uh, stamp on a round, and I just think it would be cool to have the RFT round, the JW round. Oh. Um, that's, that's why my choice, but you watch videos on your run. Isn't that a little dangerous? It's a treadmill, but it, it might be dangerous. Um, yes, train watcher Don, it could be dangerous. I need to start riding a bike. I was actually going to hit you up JW and to see what kind of bike to, to buy. Um, just to save my knees a little bit because I run... Anywhere from two to four miles a day. Um, but the thing that's going to suck is I won't be able to catch up on all my videos every morning. 
when I'm on the treadmill, I just set the iPad there and watch. And next thing I know, three mile run is done. <laughs> no, you can get a bike. And then they have the little thing that where you put it on the wheel and then you just pedal, but it doesn't go nowhere. And then you can take it for an actual ride sometimes. Oh, that, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I don't think I'm going to do that, but it's a good uh, idea. I know. I could tell. It was like an appease me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a great idea. Yeah, it's a great idea, Mary Marion. Yeah, yeah. Melt it into bars. I want to melt my all my Italian silver. All right, so I think everybody has probably had a chance to comment on the video. Um, my husband... It's probably rides, 30 rides, miles. Yeah. 30 miles, three times a week. Yeah, that's what wow. I'm thinking. That's a lot. I, I don't know. I mean, it depends. On, I mean, it probably is a lot, but if I run three miles, and if I, if I rode that same amount of time, if I'm going... I don't know. JW says he has one of those stands. See? It's cool. Even oh. though he's willing to ship it, so obviously he's not. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't like it that much. <laughs> That's funny. Um, or get an exercise bike. The only problem with an exercise bike is then I have to buy a regular bike also, because all three of the girls have bikes now. Um... So, I guess two questions. Two questions. First off would be, Nancy Barber, how long does it take him to ride 30 miles? Because my cardio, if I'm doing, if I'm just running before my workout, it's only about 30 minutes. But if I skip my workout, it's an hour. And then, JW, your short ride of, what did he say, 15 is about 15 miles. How long is that? Like, I like I know how long it is, 15 miles, but how much time does that take? Swimming is great for sore joints. I know Can Can Collectibles. I called two or three places here that um, that have swimming. My gym doesn't have um, the cool. uh, the locker rooms open, so I can't shower after I swim to go to work. But I could swim on, on after work before I come home. Um, Where are you talking about? You don't, ours doesn't have a pool. Yeah, it does. Doesn't have that outdoor pool? The Y? No. They're going to build one, but it's in like the future Oh, I thought phases. they built that whenever they <laughs> built the other add-on. Oh, no. Oh, well, I guess my gym doesn't have a pool. <laughs> <laughs> News to me. <laughs> takes about an hour to go 15 miles. What did uh, what did she say about that 30 minutes? Uh, she was saying that you should get one. It's so hilly here, it wears you out quickly. An hour to an hour and a half, she says. It takes me an hour to go 15 miles. Oh, so that wouldn't be bad. An hour cardio on the days that I don't want to do weights or run, that would be great. But you can't watch vids underwater. No, I know. I know. All right, so let's get... Can you grab me a, um, a yellow envelope down there? I'm all out. The big one. All right, so we're going to go ahead and switch over to the... Random comment picker view. And we're going to pick the winner. Hopefully everyone has had a chance to... <laughs> Galactic Coin Sacker says, swim in the shower. And that's on a touring bike, not a road bike. You'll have to teach me the difference there, JW. I need to buy a bike. I need to save my knees. I just haven't done the research yet all right so let's go ahead and pick the winner we've already switched it over here we go this is for the pcgs 69 is, there's sorry there's a question though is there one or two giveaways on the comment video two one now there's and one two yep there's two um there's two giveaways one tonight and then we'll pick the winner for the 1964 um kennedy on Saturday's winner's video. 
So there's two giveaways on the comment video, one tonight, one Saturday. Tonight is the Proof 69 Deep Cameo George Washington dollar coin, which is beautiful. Here we go. And 173 unique commenters, which is low for our comment video or our giveaways. Lo better odds for you. George Luna, good luck to all and lots of silver. There you go. George Luna, when you're watching this, be sure to email me to claim your prize. There we go. We got that set aside for him. And like I said, we will pick the winner for the 1964 Kennedy on Saturday. Switch that back. Well, that was a decent, uh, decent box, and we ended up finding 16 NIFCs, so that is cool. I appreciate everybody for joining. Thank you very much. Fiat Destroyer showed up. How you doing, Fiat Destroyer? I need to watch your latest gold purchase video. I will watch that tomorrow morning. Are we doing a raid? Who uh, who is streaming after this? And everyone could go raid their stream. Thank you, JW's Coins and Hobbies. I appreciate it, brother. Cough, cough, IG, JW's Coins. <laughs> yes. <laughs> JW's Coins. Bye-bye, guys. Instagram. Are you saying that for a raid? Is Are you are you doing a, li a live Instagram? Bye-bye, guys. Uh, that would be... Okay. Or are you just saying to go check out the Instagram to see the... To see the uh, the hammered coin or the hammered oh oh there we go freedom coins is on mom mom why do I like where is he that is good that stuff so many holes, but they're not like no 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 just go follow the IG yes follow the IG I and I will be checking that out. Again, thanks everybody. It's always we always enjoy chatting with you guys. We appreciate you guys showing up. And by the way, in case I didn't say it, thank you for the five dollar super chat. JW's coins and hobbies, appreciate it, brother. Um, but we enjoy everybody's company here. Love chatting with you, talking to you about how your guys' week went since last week. Thank you very much. Thank you all for watching the videos. The ad revenue all goes towards um, the giveaways. The uh, Super Chats, when they're not for ice cream, they go towards the giveaways. The membership goes towards the giveaways. Thank you all for that. Um, thank you very, very much. And we're going to cut out to go eat. Thank you. And we will see you guys on the next hunt. And if we don't see you on the next hunt, we'll see you next Tuesday. We're still going to be on Tuesdays, right? Yes, but... We might have to switch it to either Monday... We might, well, we might have to play with the time just um, because I think she has... Uh, I think next Tuesday is where she has the teacher conference virtual. But I, we talked about maybe just us stepping out. Yeah. I All right, we'll probably we'll still be out. on Tuesday just because it, it, uh, it's what we've been doing and it works. Um, it might just be a little solo Robin Hood a little bit, but, um, again, thank you. Good night. We'll see you next week. Appreciate you all. Good night. Good night.